This is my girlfriend, Ilaria Thomas, who teaches yoga in New York. I think she's changed her life, and I think there's a future here. Alec, let me answer. Alec and Ilaria started dating in 2011 and instantly clicked despite a 26-year age difference. They wed in 2012 and Ilaria made it clear she could hold her own in the relationship, as we saw at the Mission Impossible premiere in 2015. What was it like to see Alec back on, on, on screen again for this huge movie? I get really excited that... Uh, she, she understands the business now. You know? Notice how my husband answers the questions for me. <laughs> you know, it makes me excited that I get to take him home with me. By 2018, they already were raising four children. People think of him sometimes as just very like tough, funny, but then like has this like very serious side, and he's a total mush with the kids. Alec! Over the years, we've seen Alec embrace Ilaria's Spanish background. It is Ilaria purple. Ilaria purple. That is pretty hard to say purple in Espanol. Violeta. Last year, when people accused Ilaria of faking her accent and her connection to Spain, Alec came to her defense, saying she lived in Spain for many years as a child. And Ilaria is equally protective of Alec. Like in 2019, when he pleaded guilty to harassing a man in a parking spot dispute and was required to take an anger management class. Is he angry at home? He doesn't seem angry to me. I would say I'm the one with the anger issues. <laughs> Uh, no. <laughs> no. You know what? I have my finger and everybody behaves themselves at home. 2019 was a devastating year for the couple. Ilaria suffered two miscarriages, but the next year they were overjoyed to welcome their fifth child, followed by their sixth, born via surrogate. We saw all the kids at the Boss Baby 2 premiere with their parents in matching tuxedos like Alex's character. And it's Alex's love for his family that actually had him once contemplate owning a gun in an out eerie interview with him and Ilaria in 2017. The conversation came up when discussing the tragic Las Vegas shooting with Alec calling for stricter gun laws. I think we need to start to put guns on an equal footing with everything we have in our lives. If I was in a home invasion situation, you bet I wish I had a gun. But uh, I don't own a gun. I think about it every now and then, now that I have little kids and my wife. And then I get involved. Then my wife says, no gun. <laughs> but the idea being that, that, that uh, uh, we need to start to put gun ownership on par with a lot of things that we regulate for the same reason.